there. Guess what we're doing today? We're finding out about engineers. What's an engineer? Well, it's someone who designs roads or buildings or even machines to make people's lives easier. And they're really good at building block towers. Well, we could really use one of those. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, stick around to see more engineers today on Sesame Street. Nice catapult. Oh, muchas gracias, Alan. We made it ourselves. Oh. Yes, we are engineers. Mm -hmm. Elmo, huh? time for lunch. Oh, okay, Daddy. Oh, oh, oh. Elmo has to go. Bye. Bye. Hi. Hi, everybody. Hey, Chris. Chris. How is your ankle? Uh, it's still pretty sore, so the doctor says I shouldn't walk on it so much. What happened to your ankle, Chris? Uh, I fell, <laughs> and I sprained it, so... I have to take it easy for a while. Why don't I make you some lunch? And then maybe Rosita, Zoe, and Gabrielle might be happy to deliver to him? Oh, yes, yes, of yes, sure yes. yes, Awesome, thank you so much. Then I will go put away these apples and I will come back with your sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here is Chris's lunch. A turkey and cheese sandwich and a dill pickle on the side. Thank you, Alan. You're welcome. Hey, take care of that ankle, all right? Will do. Bye-bye. Thank you, Alan. Hey, Chris, how do we get to your apartment? Oh, you just head in through that door over there and then come right up the stairs. Hey, let's go. Yeah, well, we're hold the mustard. We're not just going to walk Chris's lunch up to him. We're, we're not? not? You're not? No, we're engineers, right? Right. right. Well, engineers solve problems by thinking of new ways to do things. Mm. Let's think, engineers. Let's think. Mm. Uh, is this going to take long? Because I'm pretty hungry. Oh, hey, wait. What if we use the catapult to throw Chris's lunch up to him? The catapult? Let's see. We could pull back the arm, put Chris's lunch on it, and let it go. Oh, well, huh. Nah, they probably wouldn't be so good for Chris's lunch if we catapulted it. Maybe it's better if you're just uh, walking up those stairs, huh? We can think of a new way to bring you your lunch. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 what's that? That's my stomach. I'm hungry. <laughs> no. I mean, what's that ropey thing? Oh. This is a laundry line. I hang my clothes on it to dry. Let me show you. Let's see, this mm -hmm. is a pulley. And you run a rope through the pulley like this, so that when I pull the rope this way, my clothes come toward me. <laughs> Let me see. Oh, yeah! Maybe we can use a pulley and a rope to pull Chris's lunch up to the window. Like in this picture, look. Yeah, but this rope and pulley goes up and down. The laundry rope goes sideways. How can we get that rope and pulley to go up and down instead of sideways? I can always untie the rope and drop it down to you. Then it would go up and down just like it does in the book. <laughs> oh, 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 great. Nice. Oh, oh great. We got the rope that goes through the pulley up there. Uh, oh, but wait, <sighs> wait, wait, wait. There's nothing to attach this bag to. Oh, yeah. That's a problem. Mm -hmm. And when there's a problem to solve, what do we say? <laughs> we say, I wonder what if. Let's try. I wonder. 
wonder what if let's try i wonder what if let's try i wonder when i'll get my lunch christopher we have to focus i wonder how we can get chris's lunch up to him mm. what if we tie this end of the rope around the lunch bag. Then we can pull with this end of the rope. Then the lunch will go up to Chris. Mm -hmm. Brilliant. <laughs> let's try. Let's, let's try. try. Come on, engineers. Let's tie this bag to the rope. There. Looks good. Okay, now we pull. Okay. Huh? It's working. <gasps> the lunch is going up. <laughs> Come to Papa Delicious Sandwich. Here it comes. Oh no! Aww. Chris's lunch bag didn't stay on the rope and slipped off. Hmm, we still have a problem. We can't get Chris's lunch up to him. And if we can't get his lunch up to him, what is he gonna eat? Mm. He, he won't have anything to eat but his shoe. He probably doesn't even have ketchup to put on it. Hey, don't worry. Uh, uh, Sully, it, it's okay. Let's stay calm. We can figure this out. It's just a tiny little problem. The lunch bag slipped off the rope. That's it. And when there's a problem to solve, what do we say? I, I wonder, wonder what if let's try. try. Hmm, I wonder if there's something we can use to put that lunch bag in and tie this rope to it. There are some cardboard boxes. What if we put Chris's lunch in a cardboard box, then tie the rope around the box and pull the sandwich up that way? Maybe the box won't slip off. Mm -hmm. Let's try. Let's try. Let's go. Okay. We tied the rope to the box. The lunch bag is in. And we pull. Okay. Looking good. Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, hey lunch at last. <laughs> Looking good. Yeah. Looking good. Uh -huh. oh. Oh. Steady and steady. Oh, 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 oh. don't jump. Oh. Oh. Chris's lunch fell again. This is too frustrating. I can't. Guess we'll just have to take Chris's lunch up the stairs. No, 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 you don't. Mm -hmm. Huh? But, uh, you don't want us to bring your lunch upstairs? I don't want you to give up. You're so close. You're engineers and you can figure this out. I know you can. You know what? Chris is right. Engineers don't give up. We have to keep trying. Mm -hmm. But the box slipped off the rope. It's a problem. Yes, but when there's a problem to solve, what do we say? We say, I wonder what if let's try. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I wonder what we can tie to the rope that won't slip off and won't be too tippy. Hey, everybody. So I just baked some pies for Mrs. Crustworthy, and I had a few apples left over. Any takers? The basket! The, the basket? Mm -hmm. That basket has apples in it, but... It's not tipping. No, it's not tipping. What if we put Chris's lunch in the basket and then tie the rope to the hurdle of the basket? I bet it won't slip or be too tippy. Let's try. Alan, may we please borrow your basket to get Chris his lunch? Oh, sure, but... Wait, Chris does not have his lunch? It's a long story. There. Rope tied to the basket handle, lunch bag in, and we pull. Yeah. Yep. And we pull. Oh, look at it going. It's going up. Almost here. <laughs> it's here. My lunch is finally here. Oh, Yay. We did it. We did it. We didn't give up, and we did it. Oh, congratulations, engineers. You worked together, and you found a new way to get Chris's lunch. That's right. We used a rope, a pulley, and a Thank you very much. <laughs> Let's see. I've got one. I've got two. I've got three. I've got four apples. Yes. Oh, wait a minute. Do uh, pickle. That's what I'm talking about. Now, this is a star right here. Look at that. Oh, you can just smell it. That's turkey. What else is it with? It's cheese, too. Come on, turkey and cheese. But they're together like friends. Oh, hi. Spot the doggy is up in a tower. Woof, woof. And I'm hungry. How will 
engineers, Starmaya and Jabba, help the doggies get their friend Spot a treat. We designed a pulley system to get a doggy treat to Spot. We've got a rope and a pulley. Now we just need something to hold our doggy treat so we can pull it up with the rope. Hmm, I wonder what we could use for that. What if we put the treat in this basket and tie the basket to the rope? Good idea. Let's try. Ready? Up to spy. We did it! Yay! Great job, engineers! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you can make a pulley system at home too. Hi, Elmo. Oh, hi, Big Bear. <laughs> uh, we hope you had fun learning about engineers today. Yeah, engineers like us. Yeah. At first, it was hard to find a new way to get Chris his lunch. But we figured out how to use a pulley and a robe. We had to try a few times, but we didn't give up. And finally, we did it. Chris got his lunch. Yeah, yeah he was really happy about it. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's kind of time for our lunch now. So, see you next time on Sesame Street. Come on and move your body and use your mind. Because you know you are growing all the time. You're getting smarter, stronger, kinder on Sesame Street. Sharing and caring every day.